will write another model which will not use any return types or which will not but the value will can be displayed so i'll say <coughs> Return type. So we can write, let's say I'll define first, I'll define one variable public static integer result. This is my first number, okay? And I'll say public static list of integer. total numbers equal to new list of integers and then I will say public static only I need a results and a public static integer number public static number yeah. Yeah. This is. so I define like this so I'll create one static method public static void yeah digits Say yard numbers only, no issues because we don't have any parameters, right? I'll take it off my parameter and I just remove this. So now we got a method. Now, how to call this method? Missing return types. This should be void. Okay, how to call this method? I'll say demo class obj equal to new demo class then obj dot get addition obj dot get addition so i call my number and then what should i we do we need to add a total number so it's very simple let's say i'm just taking this only I'll take the same for loop. Here I'll say numbers to add. I just updated my numbers to add. And then total numbers to add. Here we need to write a return. So well, what we will say? By default results is not zero. So let's say I'll say zero. For I, as I said, we need to iterate for loop, so we need to use the data type of the collection integer value column numbers to be added. Value column numbers to be added, and then what you can say results plus equal to value. Results plus equal to value. This is what the same number. So from here. I tried doing same thing, but now I'll do a little different. This is the first way of calling, I'll say first. I need to initialize my variable demo class dot numbers to add. Demo class dot numbers to add equal to three. And then demo class dot. demo class dot yard numbers and then integer int integer integer result equal to demo class one dot 
system dot Now you can see if I execute both, I'm executing both. The value remains same, right? Six. But you can see these methods and this method, which is a very easy to access, to call, to invoke. Which one is easy and which one is the right practice to do?